All right, so I have not done a video in so long, especially a video like this with me just sitting at the computer, but I had to do this because, you know, I, I just watched the 13th. Well, it's not called the 13th, but I just watched 13th by Ava DuVernay on Netflix. Um, the documentary, just documenting the government's, um, the, how the government has taken advantage of the 13th Amendment, which says that no person shall be held as a slave unless um, convicted as a criminal, right? I mean, it's a beautiful documentary. It's eye-awakening. It's educational. It's just beautifully put together. And it really documents Black history. And I think we should all watch it, right? So I also just came from um, seeing The Birth of a Nation. Mm. I mean, I just felt overwhelmed, right, with emotions, and I'm not going to give it away. So between seeing The Birth of a Nation and, you know, Cindy and I have been watching the Bible and watching 13th and everything that's going on to me, I've just been feeling like a little bit of a weight, and I felt called to do this video. So when I left Birth of a Nation, like right when it ended, I just had to pause, and I just started crying, really, really crying. Because I just couldn't understand how any human being could, number one, treat another human being that way, but how our ancestors like were slaves and how they just got up every day. When I'm sure dying sometimes was better than living. Most times better than living, but they still made it. And I just, I just felt like I needed to, to do this video to tell everyone like how important it is and we hear this all all the time but how important it is now more than ever that we do the work that we are called to do because that is the story of Nat Turner that is the story of Martin Luther King that is the story of Rosa Parks that is the story of our ancestors they all did what they had to do to make it and to make to to, to try to make the world a better place. Nat Turner was called, Rosa Parks was called, Martin Luther King was called. We were, They were all called, but those are the ones that listened. And I want more of us to be the ones that listen. More of us to be the ones that are taking action. And, and action isn't doesn't necessarily have to be standing in the street protesting or wearing a Black Lives Matter shirt or showing up at these different events. Like that's That may not be your ministry, but that may not be the way that you need to deliver your message to the world. Mine is going to be blossom. Mine is this. Mine is showing up every day and doing my best. Mine is when I see someone and I feel called to, to ask them about their purpose or I feel called to, to talk about their life, I'm going to do that. Some For some people, it is you know art. It is painting. It is whatever. But whatever your medium is, you have to do what it is that you were called here to do because now more than ever, the world needs you. And I'm begging you, like I'm taking time out to beg you and anyone that watches this to do what it is that you love and do it with passion and do it with quality and do it with love and share the message and, and, and influence others to do the same because the world really, really needs it. And I want you to know that you are not alone and I want you to know that you have everything that you need and you hear this all the time, we all do. But you are capable, you have nothing to be afraid of. You are already courageous, you are already fearless and we already have everything we need to do what we came here to do, so please do it. Stop waiting, stop being afraid, stop making excuses, do it and do it with love and do it knowing that you are supported and embraced and accepted and loved. Just do it and know that I am here and know that there are tons of people that are here for you and know that you have the spirit of God that lives within you. I love you and I want us all, please do what it is that we came here to do so we can really begin to make the strides that we want to in the world because we only have one of these. So why not take complete advantage of it and the opportunities that we have that our ancestors didn't have? Please see Birth of a Nation, watch 13th, share this video, encourage somebody else to do what they love, help someone do what they love, and let someone know that essentially they are loved and that they can do whatever it is on this earth that they wanted to. 
go see Birth of a Nation. You are not alone. I'm here. I am a resource.